everybody, it is your girl Sincerely Dree, and I'm back today with another video. So, as I talk to you down below, it is homecoming week, y'all. I'm excited. I am really excited, which is why we're doing this little vlog. This week I'm gonna be vlogging. Honestly, y'all, it is Wednesday. I'm not even finna cap. It is Wednesday. But I just want to show y'all some of what has been going on this week because it's homecoming. It's going to be one of my last homecomings as a student here. Not one of them. It is my last homecoming as a student here. So I just want to show y'all kind of what it's like. This is also because there was somebody who did comment on one of my videos. A couple months ago, not gonna lie, but I haven't had the time to get to actually responding to it well about like the black experience here at UGA. So I think this is gonna help that person just see more of what it is like to be a black student here at school. But of course it's homecoming week, so this is like elevated more than what it usually is. But yeah, I'm really excited for this week. There's a lot going on um, that the school has planned along with just like us in our black community as well, we tend to do a lot of things as well because of course when we go to a PWI, sometimes they don't really cater to the needs that the black students have. Y'all know how that goes. Um, but yeah, this week has been pretty cool. I did record a little bit of something this week, but I'm trying to keep this very specific towards homecoming things, not like y'all just watching me go to class. Like this isn't a regular ball, this is homecoming. We wanna keep it with homecoming. But I know Monday they started off, there's a homecoming like committee sort of thing. And they started off like giving free food from like 10 to three on Monday. So they were like out the wazoo. So I got some stuff with that. That was really nice because I was able to get some Chipotle breakfast that morning, which is amazing for free. Um, and then Tuesday was yesterday, I'm tripping. Tuesday, some of the black people, we had a block party here in the quad. That was pretty fun, just being able to see everybody come out. Just, it was like a nice little reunion just being able to see everybody again since like the last big event. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we did. We're all awesome. <laughs> 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 better than last <laughs> yeah. Anyway, yeah, can you video that? Um, today was Wednesday and they went skating today, but I was able to go because I had a general body meeting. I'm part of the Caribbean Student Association here, so we had a meeting for that. So I went to that, and of course, you already know I'm a resident assistant as well and we tend to have our meetings or we had a meeting today as well so i wasn't able to participate in skate night unfortunately but now we're here it's wednesday night it's it's after 11 right now but i'm gonna stay up and get some work done because like i said we're going to be active in what's going on this week because I haven't been out to many things to be completely honest with y'all and i'm excited to like really experience what it's like blah 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 you know so in order to have fun this weekend and in order to go out to all these different events this weekend you know you gotta do your work at the end of the day people know here at uga you work hard you play hard so i gotta get my work done i have a it's also midterm season as well just throw that in there but i have a test due on friday it opened today at noon and it's due friday at noon so i'm gonna try to knock that out right now and then I also have an assignment for that same exact class. It's like a little discussion thing. That's due Saturday. And the game is Saturday. We're going to be tailgate Saturday. All that sort of stuff. So I'm going to try to knock out at least that test tonight. And I'll probably work on that discussion tomorrow. Because I also want to do my nails. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm ashy. I just exposed myself like that. <laughs> but I also want to do my nails. Because you already know I'm a machine ambassador. And I did buy some nails from them. So I kind of want to try and see how, see how that's going to go. I think I'm going to make that a whole separate video for y'all or whatever. So stay tuned to watch that. See if she and nails are really good or not. Um, 
but yeah i'm excited for this week i'm gonna stop talking your ear off because i really need to go do this test and we'll probably update y'all with that after but definitely tomorrow i'm gonna show y'all what's going on because i have a lot of stuff planned for tomorrow it's gonna be fun it's gonna be cool let me show you my outfit i'll probably show y'all the outfits that i wore this week as well because of course you already know me i post on instagram all the time if i don't post on here i post on my instagram so instagram is seeing outfits but y'all have it so let's show y'all so this is what we got today she is from rainbow just a nice long sort of sundress if you want to call it really cute and then of course i'm wearing my initial necklace you already know oh hair is um the hair is outre mental hairline kamalia and I'm, I'm really liking it it's giving homecoming it's giving red go dog y'all know but um yeah let me stop talking y'all because i really gotta get this work done and then like i said y'all gonna see the whole shit in may y'all see everything that's happening this weekend because y'all gonna experience the same with me but just know we gonna have to deal with copyright and all that sort of stuff for this vlog so songs gonna sound the same and pictures start changing and things gotta get sped up or whatever you already know why but let me stop procrastinating let's do this and then let's enjoy this homecoming week hey y'all hey y'all good morning the light is terrible but it is thursday morning so just the next day from yesterday i just got finished with my class I only have one class on tuesdays and thursdays so i'm pretty much done for the day but i'm gonna show y'all real quick i'm over here in myers quad if you know campus maryland is right behind me right now let me show y'all what's going on look at this okay so if you look close this is espn college game day so they're out here on myers quad taking over let me switch y'all back real quick but yeah so espn likes to come here a college game day. if you're not familiar with like football or the sec schools and like that espn likes to go to different schools to sort of like broadcast from there depending on what the game is like or if that team is looking good if you haven't heard the finest school in the land uga is now number one in the nation after alabama took a beating from six a m this past weekend so they are back over here this is their second time being here this semester this is their third time being on campus since i've been here so that should be pretty cool even though it's kind of a little love-hate relationship i don't know much about espn and college game day because i'm not a football person i'm a basketball person but i do know a lot of the students like it here because they like to come out with their like posters and signs like that but for me the reason why i have a hate relationship with it is because it's homecoming like y'all already came they were just here the game before this the last home game they're back and i hate it because Myers Quad, if you are not familiar with this, Myers Quad, every homecoming is where the black people congregate, alumni, current students, all that sort of stuff, congregate for their tailgate. And it's usually like always a big deal every single school year. So for them to be on the quad, it's gonna be interesting. So just stay tuned for when I vlog on Saturday, just so y'all can see what that's gonna be like. Cause it's, it's gonna be a scene for sure. But yeah, let me head over to class because I am hungry. I just didn't eat breakfast today. I'm tired. And you already know there's a lot of stuff going on this weekend and today specifically. So let's head over to the room. And then we'll check back up on college game day on Saturday. Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. So I'm back to the room. It is really late. It is 10 now. A lot of stuff happened today. And all the stuff that was supposed to happen today didn't happen today. So, um... Came back to the room, I was on the phone with my sister, I was talking with her, then I went to sleep because I was tired. And then I had a meeting to run at six, actually, because you know, I'd be over some stuff. So I had to run a meeting at six, but I had a resident who had an issue, and I'm all right. I had a resident who had a lock issue, and that small minor lock issue took two hours, two whole entire hours to figure out, which was just a lot for me. like. It wasn't even like, I didn't have to do a lot to be completely honest, but it's the fact that I had to sit there and wait and wait for people to come and just make sure. Cause you know, I like to be a good RA. So I had to ensure that people could get in their room because I know I would be a little scared if I couldn't get into my room, <laughs> you know? So I ended up not having to do the meeting, but at least one of my coordinators was there. So they were able to like get the information out, blah, blah, blah. Then after that, because of where my meeting was supposed to be, you know, it's homecoming. They are having a homecoming carnival today and some of the RAs and I were supposed to go. But all of us were just like, you know, it's just not gonna work out because tonight there was also a special dinner in the dining halls. And I really wanted to go because they were gonna have a 
seafood boil and I love me some seafood. So I was like, ooh, yeah, let's all go. Let's have like a nice little RA dinner. It's Thursday night, blah, blah, blah. So I just ended up going from doing the stuff with the resident to write a report. After the report, I went to go eat dinner with some of the RAs, which was cool, but kind of a bummer because the seafood boil mm, wasn't that good. I'm gonna be honest, UGA, we have to step our game up. But it wasn't that good because like, they had shrimp and if you know anything about cooking shrimp you know they had that little line in the back and i could see it clear as day in the shrimp so i was like you know i just can't do this i can't eat it but they did also have some beef brisket some barbecue brisket and that was delicious so i just had that and i had me some smoothies and stuff and we just sat there we kiki we talked it was pretty cool got back to the room i had to talk to a resident again because you know i'll be doing my job I, mean, I just i just be doing a little something but I just finished talking to them and now I'm finna take a shower because we're gonna head out for the night. But before we head out, I was coming out here so I could show y'all the outfit that I wore today. So this is what we did. We have this little nice shirt. I believe this shirt is from Rainbow. And then we also have these leggings. These are also from Rainbow. They were actually on sale, which is why I picked them up. And then we're wearing our new Vans. So, yeah, so that's what I was wearing today, but I'm gonna show y'all that because I'm gonna take a shower, change my clothes, I'm gonna get dressed up for something else. But I need to hurry up because they're probably gonna leave me soon. But yeah, so I'm gonna do that and then I'll show y'all some of the things that I end up doing tonight and then we'll reconvene or we'll just meet back again tomorrow because tomorrow should actually be fun. I do have a good amount of stuff to do tomorrow and a lot to show y'all. We go see you. Not the vlog. She got to do her vlog.
over there with a camera permanently glued to her hand? Yes. Oh.
trans by her. She's good. How many of y'all can do that?